There's a myth that if both engines fail, the plane just drops. The truth? Every airliner is a glider with serious range. Engines give thrust, but the wings provide lift. Even without power, a jet doesn't fall out of the sky. It trades altitude for distance, gliding forward on aerodynamic efficiency. Pilots are trained for this, and the numbers are more impressive than most people realize. Take the Airbus A330. In 2001, Air Transat Flight 236 lost both engines over the Atlantic after a fuel leak. With no thrust, the crew still glided 65 nautical miles, over 120 kilometers, and landed safely in the Azores. That's the kind of glide ratio modern jets are designed for. The same logic applies to any big jet. A 747, 777 or A350 can glide for dozens of miles from cruise altitude. It won't stay up forever, but it gives pilots time. Time to troubleshoot, restart engines or divert to an airport. That's why dual-engine flameouts are rare stories of survival, not instant disaster. So when people imagine a powerless jet plummeting, the reality is the opposite. The aircraft becomes a giant glider, controllable and stable. The wings don't stop working just because the engines do. The myth of drop from the sky just doesn't match physics. So here's the debate. Knowing a jet can glide for dozens of miles, does that make you feel safer, or would an engine out still terrify you?